hi guys and welcome back to my channel so today i am going to be going down memory lane and i'm pretty sure you guys are too today we are going to be going back and looking at candy so i love candy i think i prefer candy over chocolate but that's just me i know everyone is different but today i have the 70s candy so it's basically it's that 70s mix this is all your favorite candy from the 1970s and then i also have the 80s all the candy from the 80s oh and i also have the candy from the 90s so we're going to be going back into time and we're gonna go and see what's in here uh, so, but before we get started, make sure to like, share, and subscribe. Yeah, and let's continue on with the video. So, the one I'm going to start with is that 70s, just because this is the oldest one. Um, I was born in the 90s, and so this is only like about, what, 20 years old? So, I'm going to dump out all the candy. Oh, wow, that's actually a lot. And it comes with a little pamphlet. <laughs> I think it's like the nutrition facts. So I'm actually going to go, I'm going to read this off with you guys. And I'm going to show you guys what's on here. And let's see how actually, how back far we go. Okay, so in the 1970s, the, at the atomic firebombs. So do you see them? Mm. Atomic firebombs. I want to say there's only, there's three of these. Ah. There's three of these. So let me look them up real quick. So actually, I looked these up and it says that this candy was introduced in the 1950s. What the heck? So why is it in the 1970s? Okay, so I was kind of smelling them. And it smells like freaking fireball. If you drink alcohol. So this is what it is. I'm probably not going to eat everything. Yeah, it's cinnamon. Mm-hmm. It burns. Mm-mm. Uh, no. I, holy crap. I was in my mouth for like five seconds. Uh, that's a no. So I don't like the fire bombs. Um, I do remember them though. But I'm not a, a big fan. So, okay. So the next candy that I have here is a Blow Pops. So I personally love these. This was one in 1973. So this is. Ugh. Ooh, and it's strawberry. I love this one. Okay. Yeah, I love this lollipop. Okay, the next one up is the cherry heads. Which one are those? Okay, these are the cherry heads. So the cherry heads were in actually in 1962. So I'm wondering. I've never actually had these before. That's not good. I mean, it tastes like cherry, but no. I'm not a fan of that. So, so far, out of the three candies I've tried so far, only one has actually been like a... What do you call it? Like one from the 1970s. So, this is also the 1973. So, this is... I actually love this candy. So, this is a yes for me. I can't believe it's been in the 1970s. And like, I still like... Once a year, probably get these kinds when I see them, just cause the Laffy Taffies. Are the next one? I love Laffy Taffies. I love how they usually do a joke. How is a bad joke like a broken pencil? They have no point. And what did one eye say to the other? Between us, something smells. Okay. Now we have the now later. Now and later. So the now and later is these. Like, but yeah. They're a little hard. I just opening shit and wasting it. Oh well. Okay, now I have the rain rainbow. Rainbow. Oh, these are gumdrops. I've actually never even seen nor heard of these. I'm gonna assume they're good. I mean they're just cheekless, you know, but 
I've actually never heard of these gums. Oh my god. Shut up. Okay. Anyways, the next one is Razzles. Which one's that one? Razzles? Oh. I've heard of these. It's what then it's versus Canon and Scum. Huh, I actually never tried these. Let me try one right now. Um, are they supposed to look like this? This should look like fucking dog food. Honey, then it's gum. When is it gum? Oh my god. This is hot as hell. It doesn't taste bad, but I don't like the texture of it. Does that make sense? The next one up is Smarties. So, I love Smarties. I think they're so good. Um, so, this is a win for me. The next one is Sugar Daddy. A milk caramel pop. I've seen them, but I've never, like, it's never caught my attention. It's literally caramel. Hmm. Okay, the next one is Tootsie Rolls. These, oof, oof, I love these. I love Tootsie Rolls. I love the little ones. I love the longer stick ones. I love the thicker longer sticks. These, mm. I'm gonna eat these right now. Shoot. Okay, and the last candy there's in here is the Twizzlers. I actually like Twizzlers. I don't mind them. I prefer red vines. Is there a difference between red vines and Twizzlers? I'm not sure. Anyways, just because I looked at the camera. Do you guys like my backdrop? I thought it went with the themes. I don't know. Though. Okay, so this had two, four, six, ten, twelve. Really? This, this uh, 70s bag actually had 12 candies in here. Let's review, shall we? So we have the Atomic Firebombs. Mm, I did not like. Mm. We have the Blow Pops that I do like and I should put down because that's rude. We also had the Cherry Heads. I did not like. So that's two to one. We have the Fun Dips. I love the Fun Dips. We have the Now and Laters. They're okay. They're a little hard, but they're okay. We have the Laffy Taffies, which I love. The Rainbolo ones, the Chiclis. Never had I don't want to open them because I feel like it's just a waste. It's just gum. The Razzles, this. <laughs> this is a no. We have the Smarties, this is a yes. We have the Sugar Daddy, the. This is a no. Um, we have the Tutorials, these are yes. This is my last one, so I'm going to save it. And then we also have the Twizzlers. So I would like to say out of the 12, I like. I only like half of them. Is that sad? The 70s candies, I give them half of them are good, half of them I don't like. Like, sorry. There was like three or four that I did not even know. I've seen them, but I've never even tasted them. Um, But yeah, that was the 70s. Now let's go ahead and put them back in the bag because I don't want to make a mess. And I told Luis that I would give him some. A fool am I. So let's open the next one. The next one is the 80s. Okay, so the 80s. The, girl, what the heck? This is a scam. What kind of scam is this? Okay, so the 80s. Um, so off the back, Fun Dips repeated. Sugar Daddies are repeated. The Laffy Taffies are repeated. The Razzles are repeated. The Blow Pops repeated. The are these are these just saying the sweet tarts and the smarties? Oh no, they're actually not. They're not the same. Oh, but we got the necklace smarties. And we got the Laffy Taffies again. And this is really this is really awkward. Honestly, we have a lot of the same things. We have so I'm not gonna talk about the other ones because we literally just opened them on the other ones. So I'm trying to understand why they got repeated. So maybe they were introduced in the 70s, but it wasn't maybe popular into the 80s. That's one thing I can think of. 
because the Smarties were in the other bag, but this is a Smarties necklace. So this is probably like a new product for them in the 80s. I don't know, but Smarties. So the newer ones that I did not talk about in the 70s ones, or correction, that were not in the 70s ones, were the lemon heads. The lemon heads, I think it's funny how it has like the little 25 cents. Um, I don't really like these. How about eat one? Oh, I'm gonna open them. Oh well. Let me see. So these are the lemon heads. Oh, they're not bad. Okay. So those are the lemon heads. Um, so the candy necklace, the razzles, the fun dips, the crybaby. Which is the crybaby? Wait a minute. Which one's the crybaby? Oh, this should look like it's been through some things. I am not going to eat this. Look at this. Uh, I do remember the crab baby though. I do remember that. So the crab baby, there's a mini crunch. What the heck is that? Dude, am I missing kitty? Oh look, they're having different. Okay, fine, I'll, I'll taste the blue one because the green one is looks really nasty. So these are the crab babies. I forgot they were sour as hell. That's a no. That's a big no no. Um, which one is it? The mini crunch? It's milk chocolate and sugar, but I don't have it here. So, am I missing that candy? Okay, so I'm missing the mini crunches. Um, the red hots, I also don't have. I don't have the red hot. Oh, are these, is it these ones? No. Okay, I don't have the Red Hots either, so that's two candies that I'm missing. Um, the Nerds. I do love the Nerds. Oh my god. Do you guys remember the Nerds that would like have two in one? So it would be like a bigger packet. And it would be like, it's usually like the purple and the blue or the purple and the pink. I don't know. But it would be like two little pockets. You like just like open it up and like. These have my heart. I love these. This is the one. Mm -hmm. Okay. Sweet tarts. Which so basically to me is kind of like Smarties, but hey, I don't know. Blow pops, that's that's repeated. The lemon heads were already tasted. The Laffy Taffy, we have the Smarties. Oh, it's this it's like a a lollipop Smarties. So and they have a cichlet, six slits. Like cheekless, no? I think these are cheekless, like literally six little things. Okay, so this is kind of a disappointment. The Ace was a big time disappointment because ideally, maybe like these three things are new, like the Nerds and the Lemon Heads and the Six Flits because the Sweet Tarts are basically the same thing as the Smarties. Smarties, this time came in a lollipop. Um, oh, so the other one had the Cherry Heads and these are the Lemon Heads. All right, so it's also the same thing, just different flavors. So, I'm wondering if they had like, that was kind of a bust, no? I'm wondering if they had like a, what's the word I'm looking for? Like, different flavors in that came out. But I feel like that beats the purpose, no? I feel like it was supposed to be like the whole purpose is like that candy, not that flavor. If not, it would have been flavors. But I don't know, that's just me. Anyways, I'm not gonna be too, too picky. Okay, so the last one is the 1990s, the year I was born, or the decade I was born. Um, mm. Jesus, where are you such a big disappointment? Hey, where's my little paper? This one doesn't have a paper. Well, this is very awkward. Okay, so I'm going to just go off based on what I see. Okay, so we also, again, have crybabies. So, this is the same as the 80s. So, 80s and 90s kind of have the same thing. Um, the Laffy Taffies. The Laffy Taffies were literally in every box. The 70s, the 80s, and the 90s. So, kind of another disappointment there. Um, the Cry Now, or the Now and Laters. Those were in the 70s, but they were not in the 80s. So, that's also very weird. I don't know, some of these just don't make sense to me, how, whatever. Um, the Laffy Taffies. Okay, I'm gonna put these away, because they're like, 
the nerds had those in the 80s okay um the lollipop sweet tarts also had those in the 80s okay so based off what i can see here based off what i can see guys i'm gonna start off with these ones bazookas bazooko bazooka i've never heard of these oh my god the chicles okay so oh these chicles remind me of something so back when i was little rebelde used to be a thing i love rebelde and rebelde had like little stickers like these and spongebob ones too if you were to mexico oh my god oh um, it's a joke i like chicles i've actually never had them nor have i seen them so it's kind of like a okay um the next ones i see are the little hamburgers oh my god i freaking love these mini burger gummy candy i love these these were so good oh my god they have a spongebob one they used to have like a hot dog one they used to have a pizza one i'm gonna eat this i don't even fuck with these these are really good i definitely like those those are the burger and gummies anything gummy like that i love so that's really shocking. Well, not really. I guess uh, it came out in the 90s. Because I mean, when I was little, when I was growing up, like I would hell buy those at the little trocas. But hey, um, the next one is Airheads. I I used to like Airheads, but then after like a while, like I just hated how much they would stuck on my teeth. And it would be so much sweetness in like a longer pack. And I was just like, no. But I like the Airheads. The Airheads. So this is new for the 90s um gummy bears i love gummy bears i go to cold stone and i get like chocolate or cotton candy ice cream with gummy bears mixed in it bomb or add some vodka or something some tiki no it's vodka i think you're tiki i don't know and put that with gummy bears bombs hell too gummy bears that's also the 90s i could have sworn gummy bears were like earlier no 1922 1922 22 almost almost 100 years later but they somehow brought these up as like a 90s count 90s so i'm i don't know if it was like the little ones maybe the little ones are the ones that like came in the 90s but i gave me a visa 1922 huh very interesting so we have the gold the um, golden bears those are pretty good um, we also have the sours. The sour, what are they called? The sour patch toys. I love these. When I was in elementary, I don't know if you guys, when you guys, I don't know if you guys remember this, but like, you know how like if you were to do like good and stuff like in school, in class, like whether it was like participation or like homework or things like that, you got like coins. Like teacher would give you like little tokens or coins or like I don't know tickets. And then, like, every Friday, you can redeem them for, like, whatever you, whatever the teacher had. I always, my fan has always bought these because these are so good. I always bought the Sour Patch Twist or, yeah, or the Trocas, like, the ice cream trucks or whatever. Like, I would buy these. These are really good. So, I'm actually really surprised that those came out in the 1990s. 1990s the 1990s i love these i really like the, the like the skinny the longer ones the skinnier ones those are my favorite and the last thing that i can see from the pack is mike and ike oh my god there was like years in my life where i was obsessed with these tree had these for like a dollar obviously bigger and I would freaking eat them. We used to have like game nights at my house like every weekend when my uncles and my aunts and cousins would come over and like we would buy candy or they would bring candy and they were new. They had to bring me this because like I loved, loved Mike and Ike. It even went to a point where like I think at some point Mike and Ike wasn't even Mike and Ike no more. It was like, it was like Mike's and then the other ones were like Ike's. I don't know, but these are really good. And honestly, I do miss eating these candies, so I'm gonna pop one in right now. My favorite was strawberry. Basic or what? Fortunately, that's all the candy I have. Um, I'm kind of upset that like all three of them have like the same candies. If that makes sense. Like, let me see. The blow pops were in the 70s and the 90s. And the fun dips were also the 70s and the 90s. The Laffy Taffy's were in all three of them. So that's kind of like. 
I'm trying to understand like what how they managed how they did this because this is all your favorite candy from that like little decade or whatever so I'm trying to understand if it's like the create and some of them were not even on the like the year the decade they said it was like I know there were some candy that was like in the 70s but they were like in the 60s or like before that so it's kind of like how did they do this like did they do it because like that's when it was popular because obviously some of them weren't even made in that decade so I'm really wondering how they actually thought about this and how they went if they did it by flavor but the whole purpose was it because the candy of that freaking decade but I don't know that's me let me see please leave a comment down below of what candy I guess you like the most or like what you remember the most if that makes sense I'm gonna read them off so just so you guys know so the 70s had atomic fireballs blow pops cherry heads fun dips laffy taffies now and laters uh rain blow razzles smarties sugar daddy twist tootsie roll and the twizzlers so let me know if you're more of a 70s person um i like some of the candy but not all of it if that makes sense so I do remember a lot of their candy. Okay, so now the 80s. The 80s had the Airheads, the Blow Pops, the Candy Necklace, the Crybabies, Fun Dips, Laffy Taffy, Nerds, Red Hots, Razzles, Six Lits, Smart Pop, and Sweet Tarts. Um, I don't remember receiving, or like in here, having the Red Hots, uh, but that's just me. I didn't get the Red Hots in this one. This one's kind of like a, okay, cool, like, I know a lot of these. So, as a 70s, a 90s, I mean 80s, I prefer the 80s, but, you know. Now, I don't know if I'm a little biased because I was in the 90s, I was born in the 90s or what, but I feel like I like more the 90s one than, like, the other two. Uh, so, let me read you the 90s. So, the 90s is Airheads, Bazooka, Bazooka, I still don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. Crybaby, Gummy Burger, the um, Golden Bears, the Laffy Taffies, Mike and Ike, Nerds, Now and Later, Smarty Pop, and the um, Sour Punch Twists. So for me personally, I think it's the 90s, just because like I really like the the Sour um, the Sour Punch, the Gummy Bears, the Mike and Ikes, and all that stuff. But I do like the Tootsie Rolls from like the 70s so I do like candy from all three different decades I guess I just prefer the 90s I don't know if that makes sense I like the Tootsie Rolls so that's my favorite the least favorite I think has to be I don't know there's a lot of them actually I think it's the Tommy Fireballs Fire Fireball I think so I think that's the most because Nothing was gross. It's cinnamon, you know. But then again, I really like Fireball, like the alcohol, because that just gets me. And it's not that bad of a taste, so I don't know. Um, but yeah. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. And please comment down below what was your favorite, how I said. And yeah, make sure to like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.